Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to a very special vlog. I'm very excited about today. We are doing something that we have wanted to, well, I've wanted to do for years, years now. But we just had to, you know, timing and everything like that. We just had to make sure everything was, you know, all good. And finally, after many, many years, we are getting a second dog and I'm so excited. This one's no longer gonna be an only child. <laughs> she has no idea, but I'm hoping that, um, you know, she. I'm, I'm sure she will handle it well. It's not that she doesn't like other dogs. She just is scared of dogs that are bigger than her, but obviously this puppy will be smaller than her to start out. We are getting a beagle. It's one of the smaller beagles, so it shouldn't be that much bigger than her. So I think it'll be completely fine. And like I said, with a puppy, it's going to be smaller than her. She's going to be like, okay, you know. So I'm a little nervous just because she's my number one priority. And I want to make sure that, you know, everything's like right for her, which is part of why we waited and, you know, all that fun stuff. But I finally feel like she's ready. We're ready. So I'm very excited to go get a puppy and... Yeah, so I'm gonna take you guys along with me. I'm so excited and I probably won't vlog much on the way there. It's it's a pretty lengthy drive, so I probably won't really vlog there, but I will definitely vlog when we get our puppy and vlog when her and Dixie meet and all that fun stuff. So I just wanted to start out this vlog. Very, very excited and yeah, well, let's go get our puppy. Okay guys, meet Daisy. Isn't she so cute? She's so tired. She's been sleeping most of the ride back home. It is almost two o'clock. We're almost home. And then she gets to meet her sister. Yeah, you get to meet your sister. So cute. Dixie May, hi, hey baby, look, look at this, yeah, look at, <laughs> she's like, she's like, I don't know what this is, look at this cute baby, Dixie May, you be nice to the cute baby. Hey, hi baby. Hey guys, it is hours and hours and hours later. It has been quite the day. We have done a lot of things. We've been up since 6 a.m. Um, so we got up, went and got our new puppy, brought the puppy home, played with her, played with Dixie, introduced them. It actually has gone really, really well. Dixie is slightly jealous, but she's not like being mean or anything to the new puppy. She's just like, if we have the new puppy in our lap, she just doesn't want anything to do with you, which is fine. Like if that's the worst that she's like acting right now, then it's totally fine. But, and I know she'll, you know, it just takes time. She's not used to having another dog in here. So it's just going to take time, but I'm happy that she's not scared of her and she's not like being mean to her. And actually when the puppy's not in our lap, she kind of wants to like play and interact with it. It's only whenever the puppy's like in our space. And so totally fine, totally understandable. Um, new puppy is doing great. She, I don't, I think she's only had one accident in the house today that I know of. 
So, um, she's, she's just great. They're both just great. So, new puppy is so tired though, which I mean, she's had a long day. I guess I should just call her Daisy. I don't know why I keep calling her new puppy, but Daisy has um, done really well. So, anyway, we are exhausted though. And I'm, I'll probably continue this vlog for a couple days because I feel like I wanted to make this a longer vlog. But um, like I said, we, we left early, we got the puppy, then we had to leave to go help set up for VBS for our church. But James's mom came over and hung out with the dogs while we were gone. So like I felt comfortable leaving them. So otherwise I probably would have just stayed with them you know because i didn't want to just like get a new puppy and then drop her in a space that she was uncomfortable with and then leave you know and she actually doesn't seem like she's uncomfortable but you know what i mean i didn't want to do that so um we did that and then we had to do a couple of errands and we actually have been decorating we are having a baby shower here at our house tomorrow so uh it is for our sister-in-law and so we set up part of that and I'm going to set up some more in the morning but yeah it's just been a long day and we are tired so I'm going to continue this vlog throughout the next couple of days so you guys can kind of like see the dogs interact with each other and it'll be like a fun vlog but yeah I apologize that I've just not been on my vlogging game today because it was just it was a good day but it was a long day and it's very tiring look at the puppy in James's lap just sleeping it it cracks me up how she like turns her head and like lays and like yeah and then we've got little dixie who's kind of pouting because she wants to sit in james's lap but the new puppy is in james's lap you're not happy that daisy's taking your spot yeah anyway here's kind of like the setup we have going so far like i said we're gonna do um more tomorrow we've just done like some a few things so all right, you ready for bed? <laughs> you excited for that new puppy? James, are you ready for bed? Yep. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, I don't even know the last time I vlogged in this vlog. This week has been insane just with new puppy and just puppy things. I have been a terrible vlogger and I'm so sorry. It's just been a lot and actually I had to take puppy to the vet today because she was sick. Everything's fine. Everything is perfectly good, but I had to, you know, I just wanted to make sure everything was okay. I figured everything was, but I also was like, we got a teeny tiny baby here. It's been a while since I've had a puppy and just wanted to make sure everything was good so I took her to the vet this morning and it's just been kind of a chaotic day honestly because I took her to the vet but I locked my purse and the spare car key in my car and James has the other car key so um, I couldn't actually drive her I had to call James's mom and thankfully she was able to go with me and take the puppy to the vet but um, that happened my grandma was having surgery today everything's fine but of course I was like waiting to hear back about that and see how everything went with that so it's just a lot of like anxiety <laughs> and like craziness today and I'm so tired I'm also trying to clean up the house because like I said puppy life but also having the house kind of torn apart for the baby shower this weekend was a lot I don't even know if I mentioned that in this vlog I honestly don't even remember what I vlogged this week has just been like but we had our sister-in-law's baby shower here so I actually cleaned out my entire office and had everything like in our bedroom, my back room here, James's back room. If you guys didn't know, we have a three bedroom house, but um, I never showed the two back rooms because they have storage and it was really bad this weekend with moving all the furniture pieces in there. And yeah, so my house is looking like a hot mess, um, but we are surviving puppy life. I am so in love with her. She's so precious and Dixie's actually getting along with her pretty well. So that's good. Potty training's going well. Um, and she's actually learning to like be in her playpen without crying. And she's also learning how to be in her crate at night without crying too much. So finally getting some sleep again because I was like so sleep deprived over the just everything going on this weekend. But anyway, let me show you guys. So we got this little like pop up 
playpen thing. We had it for Dixie to use when she was a baby. I know, I know. And I've got a couple of her toys in here. Um, I had more, but Dixie wanted to play with them, so we took them out. We gotta go through our toy selection here because now having two dogs, we're gonna have lots of toys. I know, I'll get you in just a minute, okay? Um, so here's what my office is looking like. I rearranged it a little bit, moving this piece here. I like swapped them. Um, I've got kind of a mess going on there because I was trying to work on t-shirt orders, which my heat press died, so I had to order a new one of that. It's just been, it's been one of those weeks. When it rains, it pours, but I kind of have, I'm starting to get things back to being organized. I won't even show you this back room back here because there's still a ton of stuff in there, but um, I have the carpet cleaner out. I need to actually empty it and put that away. I've got the vacuum out, but yeah, guys. I don't even want to show you my kitchen. It looks like it's trashed. It's absolutely trashed. So I need to gather all the garbage. That for sure will take out a lot of this and I'll feel a lot better if I gather the garbage. We've got um, food containers here because new puppy has figured out where the food bowls are and she wants to eat big sister's food, which she shouldn't be doing. And then big sister doesn't get to eat, so I actually have her food right here because I was like, at least she can get up on the couch and kind of eat when she wants to. I'm talking about you, yeah. <gasps> oh, it's okay. I'll get you in just a second. Oh, she's so cute. Anyway, so yeah, I just kind of spent a few minutes tidying up here, and then I think I'm gonna get her out just for a little bit to play with her, and then we will do the kitchen. All right, guys, it is currently day, not even sure, today's Thursday. So we've almost had baby for a week now. You guys, oh my gosh, I have to tell you a funny story. So first off, I have to put Dixie's food up here so the puppy won't get it. But Dixie doesn't like to eat her food all at once. She likes to graze. So trying to just figure out how to make that work with a puppy that literally wants to eat everything, put everything in her mouth. But um, anyway, my funny story is I went to go get ready. So I put... I put Daisy in here, and I think I showed you guys this early. It's just like a little playpen. Put some of her toys and everything, and sitting there, just like getting ready, and all of a sudden, Dixie starts going crazy, and she's like barking, and I can hear her scratching at the playpen, and she was mad that I put Daisy in the playpen. So I'm like, okay, we've unlocked protective big sister mode here. So that's pretty funny. Do you like your baby sister? Yeah. You like your big sister? Is she protecting you? So, life with two dogs. It's definitely been an adventure, for sure, but I knew it would be. I've had more than one dog at a time before. It's just been like a long time since then. But, but I honestly am just gonna probably end the new puppy vlog here because I want to um, I want to edit it for you guys, but I also want to start getting back to the regular content on this channel, which is like cleaning, grocery hauls, day in the life vlogs, and I feel like this puppy has taken up a lot of my time, which I knew she would, but I'm like, finally, we're finally kind of getting into a routine. I feel like she's getting comfortable, like she's doing really, really well, and big sister is finally adjusting to her, so I feel like we're in a good place. So actually today I'm going to be cleaning. I'm not going to film it today because I just need to get my house back in order. It's driving me insane. But I think tomorrow I'm gonna film like a grocery haul, like grocery shopping sort of video. And then Sunday I'll film a Sunday reset video. And then we will get back to like our regular scheduled content on this channel. But thank you guys for being patient with me for watching this video. I'm so excited about the new puppy. I'm just, I'm so happy that she is in our lives, that she's in our family now. And I just know it's gonna be a lot of work but it's going to be so rewarding just like it was with Dixie and yeah so anyway uh that is it for this week's video thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys very very soon with the regular scheduled content bye guys